my name is Kostas Alexis, and this is my colleague, Margarita Kli. Uh, we are presenting the project called Airworks, and when we were started working on preparing the project proposal, we had in mind uh, a great problem, uh, and the fact that uh, almost 9%, for example, of China GDP is invested in infrastructure, and almost 4% of European countries' GDP is invested in infrastructure, significant part of which is or invested on infrastructure inspection and maintenance tasks, so to keep our infrastructure going and working properly. Uh, so far, human operators have to do this job, it's a dirty job, of course, and dangerous, and they have to go to the field and execute all these missions, and our idea is to automate this process using area robots. Uh, and our plan is to assemble what we call a collaborative team of area robotic workers. These are small robots, miniature size, inherently safe, that they, they have the perception capabilities, the path planning capabilities, and the error manipulation skills to go reconstruct the environment, come up with a high fidelity model that any, any company can use, any asset owner, uh, detect risks and damages, and subsequently could proceed to repair partially the infrastructure using their error manipulation skills. And we want to establish these capabilities at every single robot, but also to exploit them by assembling a big thing. And uh, on the scientific challenges, we have uh, a great deal um, to deal with. Um, so first of all, every agent needs to be uh, entirely autonomous. And that means that every, every aerial robotic worker needs to be able to um, perceive its motion and its environment while it's moving. So this will give some autonomy in navigation. And also, uh, we are aiming for real-time path planning and dexterous manipulation for every agent by, its, by itself. Then, on top of that, we aim to bring this, uh, all of this a step higher, and that means um, bringing the collaborative aspect, where we are looking to have a team of robots that is actually a lot more than just the sum of uh, its individual um, components. And what do you see as the best outcome for your project? So yeah, uh, we have uh, two end users. That's uh, Selecto Craft. It's a NASA owner of, of uh, power generation systems in uh, Sweden. And Arsenal Inspection Robotics. This is a service provider of uh, area robotic inspection and maintenance tasks. And our goal is, as a short term goal, is to make these people as prototype end users of our technologies. Subsequently, to have uh, infrastructure-related companies to use technologies, area robotic technologies like this. And finally, we believe that robotics also is a job creation area, high-tech job creation. And we hope that uh, European countries can play a significant and major role in that and also create uh, proper jobs for our young employees. And also from a scientific perspective, we are looking to push research in robotics in all these different fields that are involved a step further. Uh, we are exploring new ground. Uh, of course, building on whatever uh, our colleagues have, have done in the past. And let me say that uh, we believe that it's time that robots can become autonomous. So we are working in the field of area robots years now. Uh, I mean, not so many years, but a uh, significant amount. And so far we are struggling to make the robot be able to work. Now we believe that the robot should be able in recent years to execute the full mission by itself.